What's up, guys? Today we're going to be reacting to My Hero Academia Season 6, Episode 13. Last time, Endeavor got back into the fight. Mirio is back with his powers, and it seems like Compress has something up his sleeve. So make sure to subscribe down below to keep up with more My Hero and other shows I'm reacting to. It helps out a lot, and let's just jump right into this. Oh, thank God he's okay. Oh, she's okay, too. Thank God. Are we really not going to lose that? Like, anyone? Uh, what's Compress going to do? He says he has a big story pat background. Black <laughs> Abide. Right. What are you going to do, Compress? The final... Oh, I should have never read that. Oh, we're actually getting it? Fuck, I thought there was going to be a mystery. What the hell? おにげを差別し、方向に移し、クソ野郎ども。だろ。トカゲがいる。いがらわしい。まだ。こいつら。やられたトカビとは。出て行け。おお、ノー。ディア、アフターザット、ユーガナファキンアタックインザキャンドス
what the fuck is Deku gonna do? Let's be real. He has no limbs, all fucking arms, legs. He's fucking fighting with his tongue. What is this? It's like future sight. Because he saw him escape before he escaped. Fourth quirk? Dangerous sense. At least this one's not as dangerous. Hopefully. Fuck. So that's making him pass out? Mirio is gonna fucking. Ooh! Mirio is the best counter. <laughs> Shit, he's bleeding a lot. Damn. A supporting character, shit. <laughs> really saying Spinner's a star? I think he's the most background character in the league. Gonna put the hands on him? Ooh, fuck. Don't tell me Mira's gonna get killed. Oh no, Mirio, get the fuck out of there. Oh, he's cracking. Yo, what the fuck is that? What the fuck is this? Oh, that was a combo. Oh, fuck. Now what? Oh, he's up. And he's... Oh, shit. Oh, this is... All for one. Oh, dude. Oh. Oh, he's looking like him. Um... What the fuck? He looked exactly like him. Fuck. Dude, he's like crack. Oh, this is gross. Dude, his eyes. He's gonna leave him? This isn't Shigaraki, though. What? Yeah. Oh, you don't realize? You don't hear this? Dude, if he completed it, that would have been bad. So, is he gonna be gone for the rest of the show? Fuck. Is it only is he gonna? Oh no. Oh. Shit. <laughs> yeah, you're gonna go for it. Oh. Are they just forgetting they have a fucking decay quirk that will fucking disintegrate you? Fuck, that genus is done. Uh, is it just gonna be them and the people Shigaraki hat um, Spinner have in his scarf? I don't think he's gonna move. Nope, they're getting away. Yeah, the no moves are just bringing them. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Shit. Ooh. How the fuck is he dodging this shit? Got him. Useless of the Hamazuka. Oh no. Ooh. Yeah, he did kill a lot of people. Don't get back up. Don't get back up. You feel bad for him. <sighs> don't don't do this shit. He's evil. He's evil. Don't do the fucking demon slayer. Feel bad for every fucking villain. So the League of Villains is what, just Dobby and Toga now. Like everybody else got left behind. And the fucking computer guy. Dude, they got fucked up. I'm surprised we didn't lose any main characters. It's crazy because. In the beginning of the show, Aizawa said, if you break everything, you're going to be useless in the fight in the end. 
and he did that and he was useless in the end like if he didn't do that oh is that that was his costume everybody oh that guy's hat that's momo's teacher is she dead no shot midnight's dead why didn't they show her they just showed the mask with blood maybe if we did lose some people why didn't they show her? they showed everybody else they did show momo's teacher which was a very background character and they didn't show midnight really no way midnight's dead i mean it makes sense to lose background characters like you know some heroes I don't know. Maybe we did lose some people, cause like we didn't like we only lost um, Crust. I think the Shield guy. Really, of, of what I can remember, we haven't lost anybody like you know, main to the show. But I feel like this would be. I mean, and then we lo we lost. I mean, hero wise, we did lose um, twice, but hero wise, I feel like it would be, it would take away a lot if nobody died. Now, Midnight's been around since season one, so if she's dead, because I don't know why they would show everybody, then they just show the blood with her mask. That's very, this person's dead, but we don't want to show it. Maybe censorship, or maybe, you know, just like, she got fucked up, you know, because she wasn't looking too great last time, and there was a bunch of fucking villains surrounding her, so, yeah. Uh, that, that shot just gave me death vibes, but... She's been around for a while, so, I mean, it won't be the craziest death. You know, it's not like one of the students getting killed or one of the main teachers getting killed, but that's still a pretty decent death. And then they did the same thing with Momo's teacher, which is a very background character, but I'm sure that will affect Momo. You know, if your teacher dying, of course, that's going to affect them because it just showed his hat. But, yeah, it seems like this arc is done. Shigaraki got away. Well, not even it's all for one. So left behind Compress, who might just die. And Toga's nowhere to be found. She's on the way. But who knows where the hell she is. And it seems like now those people are the marbles. Can Compress like let them go now? Like, are they gonna be stuck as marbles? If he dies, do they revert back to normal? Because <laughs> they're basically dead then <laughs> um i think this is the end because there's i know there's a week break from now till um the next episode it's not coming back until the new year uh, i really enjoyed this arc it was very good um uh, it really brings back my hope for my hero academia the past season and a half wasn't the best i liked the my villain uh little arc at the end of the last season but besides that that season kind of it kind of sucked. I'm not going to lie. It wasn't the best My Hero there was to offer. And then, of course, the school, the show, talent show shit wasn't my favorite either. I feel like a lot of people didn't like that. There was way too many episodes for that. I did not need 12 episodes for that. Um, But this really brought back my hope for My Hero. It really shows it, and it puts stakes in it. I feel like that's another problem with My Hero. There's a lot of... um. They'll do this, and then the next arc will be like, oh, we gotta pass our math test, or some stupid shit, like, I don't know. It's just like, it goes from, we're gonna die, to, oh no, we might not get our next license, and it's like, well, you're gonna not, you're not gonna sit there and die if the villains start attacking, like, let's be, it's a fucking TV show. But that's one of the problems I have with my hero. Just it goes from like, oh my god, everybody might die in two seconds, or nothing really that that matters. But like I I understand it sometimes, but sometimes I just go way too overboard with it. But this really brought it back, and it seems like it might just get, it might just keep going, keep going, keep going. Of course, there's gonna be like little breaks in between. I'm sure it's not gonna be like balls to wall full time, but it seems like the stakes are gonna. Because we're getting more into, like, I know even though they're students, we're getting more into, like, the pro scene. So, you know, it's just, it seems like there's going to be, they're going to be doing more work with heroes instead of school. You know, I feel like, hopefully, they start focusing on that. I wouldn't mind if they did, like, another UA tournament thing. Like, if they do, like, a time skip or something, because they're still first years. But, like, I wouldn't mind that. But besides that, I really hope it sticks to the hero work. But, yeah, I really like this. Good episode. And uh, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Peace out.